All right, so I wanted to make a video real quick just to talk about um, the pedals. James was uh, kind enough to send me a couple pairs of these to test on our bikes. Um, so unlike your traditional pedal, the size of them is way bigger. So I got Matt here to demo. So go ahead and put your foot on the pedal. You notice when he does that, he can adjust his foot forward or back a little bit. But regardless of exactly where his foot is, and usually we instruct people to put it right in the middle, he's gonna have most of his foot on that pedal. So he's not gonna just have, like your traditional pedal that's much smaller, you're gonna just have either just your forefoot or your midfoot or your heel, but not the whole thing on there. So what tends to happen, especially on the spin bike or the Airdynes, um, is that you tend to get all the pressure in your quads or your hamstrings. You have a hard time kind of using your whole leg. And we use the spin bike, especially for things like HICT, where we crank up the resistance. So Matt's gonna demo, so resistance is way up there. And then he just does one, about 40 or so cadence per minute. Um, and if you didn't have the nice, big flat platform when you're doing that, you're always pushing through your toes or through your heel and you're not really getting an even distribution, not using your whole leg. So that's been our feedback from clients so far and personally. Um, so we really, really like these. They're also really sticky. Um, and if any of you guys know, if you sprint on the Airdyne bikes, your foot will slip off a lot of the time, especially when you start, which is really annoying. With these guys, that's never gonna happen. So it's been a huge upgrade for us.